Hello everyone! Uh, welcome to Spiritfarer! I have played once before and last time I played we met lots of fun characters. Uh, we explored a couple of places. We met like a frog which was my favorite um, and we just just started just started this beautiful game uh everybody say hello youtube and let's dive into i guess this would be like part two <laughs> okay so i'm gonna have to remember what i was doing what were we doing a little vegetable garden <gasps> i forgot about our vegetable garden and we we built this like flowery garden and we have our friends let's go meet our friends let's go say hello to the frog which is my favorite looking looking frog there seems to be quite a few new faces abroad i like it don't get me wrong i just don't want you to forget about your uncle at all you know me, I'm Mr. Personality. It's too dark to navigate, it'll be possible again at dawn. So I guess we need to sleep, but I just want to say hi to everybody. Let's go hug let's go hug our snake friend. Oh, you're sweet. That was so cute. And then we have our I think this deer was with us at the beginning. They're like our guide. I've been thinking about father recently. When he left with Doug, I didn't feel anything. No sorrow, no hate, no relief, nothing. It didn't really matter to me, but it mattered to you. And you spent three days crying in Aunt Petunia's room. I brought you three sisters and gave you that damn oversized sweater I had knitted a month prior. Mom was appalled, but you felt better. I've long wondered why you were so sad, and the best I could come up with is that you were sad in my stead. Oh no, the feelings. <laughs> feeling things I couldn't feel myself. Oh, is anyone else's heart just like, um, very overwhelmed right now? Does anyone live up here? Oh, this is the kitchen. Oh, I remember we can cook things. Let's cook an eel let's go for it that's gonna take a minute maybe we can go have a little nap let's go have a little nappy news in our own bedroom wait i think wasn't there a way to go like down down like through things <gasps> okay let's go up and go to bed Sleep until morning. Yes. Oh, it's so beautiful. A little houseboat. Oh, big stretch. Big, big stretch. Okay, come here, little cat. Maybe we can uh, charter somewhere. Oh, Albert Shipyard. Do we have like an active quest? The drawing board. Upgrade your blueprint station again at Albert's shipyard. Okay, so I'm guessing we need to go there. Visit the spot Summer has marked on the map. Okay, so do we listen to Atoll or Snack Friend? I'm guessing this. Quartz Dragon. No. Is is that is this it? The new place? And that's the other door. Let's go back to the shipyard because I feel like we're quite close to the shipyard at the moment. Um, confirm travel. We're like right next to it. Let's go see if we can do an upgrade. <gasps> can I ring the bell? Ring the bell! Time to get up everybody! Atoll, Summer, I'm so bad with the names. <laughs> Um, I, I'm just calling them by their little name, their little animal names. Let's water our plants. There's so much to do in this game. Um, do we just chop this down? Then can we plant... <gasps> Should we plant some coffee beans? Because I think that's... Is that 
Um, coffee beans are... Wait, we need to water them. Are they our little dear friends? Favourite food? Oh, 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 oh. I need, I need to water them. There we go. Jump down. Oh, <gasps> okay. Sure, sure, sure. Hello there, young lady. I guess you must be the new spirit bearer. Happy to make your acquaintance. I'm Francis. You can say I'm sort of a wandering merchant. See, I'm very fond of things. Objects, curios, trotchkas. I just buy everything. Simply put, I will buy anything you don't want anymore. I'm sure you've come across a few valuable treasures already. So tell me, what is it you want to part with? Ooh. Sell? Oh, old shoes. We can sell things and maybe keep the... The old carpet. And a necklace. Do we want to... Still smells pretty bad. We should probably sell these makes for an ashtray is there anything else we can sell i guess we can sell like food wow just squid things worth a lot of money proof that beautiful does not mean expensive i don't know if we might need these so i'm just gonna sell like a few things can we buy things I guess we can buy back what we've... Ooh, what's this? An odd seed. Do we have 500? Turn into anything. <gasps> I want a mystery seed. Empty bottles? I don't know how many empty bottles we have to catch lightning. Ooh. Okay, so now that we've talked to... Ooh, let's talk to... I think... Is this Gwen? I think it's Gwen. Hmm, I could go for an amuse bush. Is everybody hungry? Oh, she's hungry. We can give her some coffee. I like to try the whole menu, not the same dishes. No, no, but that's your favorite, I think, the coffee. What about some fish? Thanks, I love it. Oh, hello. Okay, how do I get to the, the junkyard? Oh, I used the boat. I remember now. Perfect, we can talk to our shark friend again. Stella! Hello, Mr. Sharkington. I've been getting your mail here for the past month. I am not a post office. You need to add a mailbox to your boat. If I get one more letter filled with glitter, I'll lose it. I'm warning you, you might be a customer, but I, do, I reserve the right to yell at you. Oh no. Get it done. Um, I can, can I upgrade? Ooh, hobbyist. Okay, okay. Boat size. Wait, we can upgrade our, oh no, we can get a mailbox. Okay, we could get... I think we have all of these. We have the field, the garden, the guest house, the kitchen. Wait, what? So we have a sawmill, a loom, and a foundry. Wow. Okay, can we do this? <gasps> awesome. Oh, wow. I think we spent all our gold. We've done some upgrades. Well, this is very exciting. They heard they just fired an employee at the popcorn factory. He was a good worker, but they found him sleeping on the cob. <laughs> Please. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's perfect. Okay, let's get back to our little boat and see the changes that have happened with the with the ship now. How do we? How do we take a look? This is the thing we use. Oh, we've got more space over here. Oh, oh that's so exciting. Improve. 
Wait, we can improve things? What does... What does that mean? Oh, <gasps> no! What? We can add things to the things? We can't afford them right now? But we... Oh, that's so cool. Okay, so we need to build... A foundry. Oh, we need the resources first. So we need more quartz for the loom. We need linen and maple for the the sawmill. And we need coal and oat for the the thingies. For now, I guess I'll just sort of move things around. Wait, what does this do? Edit Gwen's house. I'm gonna pop it here because we got space now. And maybe I'll put the other house, the other guest house with Gwen's house. Uh, that. And then the houses are together, the fields are together. That seems logical. <laughs> oh, look, he's jumping down. Okay. Right, so I guess now we have to gather resources. I think. It gets so cozy. It feels so cozy. I wonder where we go now. Should we talk? I've got some fiber I brought. I was going to use it to weave some thread for you later, but if you want, I can give it to you now. Oh, yes, please. Here it is. We've got linen fiber. That's perfect. And she looks very happy as well. She doesn't like Atoll's banging. Oh no, Atoll. What are we going to do with Atoll? I guess maybe Atoll shouldn't live next door to Gwen. I'm going bananas on this ship. I don't have anything to do. I've got this surplus of energy. I need to get my hands busy. Can you do me a solid? You've always been my favorite niece. You know that. I think I need a place to focus that energy. In a sawmill. <laughs> yeah, you're just missing some of the key components. Materials, which I'm sure you can find on nearby islands. I'm counting on you to help me out. I'm sure you don't want your old uncle to sleep on the deck, right? Okay, so. Woodwork. Build a sawmill. So if we go back to the drawing board, we can see what we need. And then maybe we can go to a nearby island. Okay. Sawmill is this one. Maple logs and linen threads. Let's go and search for an island. You've upgraded your boat! Hmm, that's weird. Don't tell Albert, but he left some boats loose. He was probably just in a hurry. Give me a second. Here we go. Oh, mama. That did more than I thought. Let's see here. Whoa, this boat's got some advanced options now. First up, you can travel safely and not go through all the dangers that the sea has to offer. When you're using your map, you just need to toggle on safe travel mode. It's that simple. And don't worry, it won't stay on forever. Next time you select a destination, it won't be on. I hope that helps. What else do we have here? Oh yeah, the engine's been boosted. You can now set mo oh, multiple destinations. That's exciting. That's pretty handy. You can set your course and let the... Oh, I like that. Because I get so distracted. Like, I'm like, oh, I'll go there next. And then I go somewhere different. So maybe we can just keep to the original plan now. Besides that, it's just a bigger boat with more room. Well, have fun. Okay, give me this console. We want to go Francis, the wandering merchant. We don't need Francis. What's this? Why is there a bus here? Have we been to this? We've been to the harbour. Let's go to this place. Um, confirm travel. Oh, fishing is so relaxing. Ah, oh, we got a, a message in a bottle. Wait, can we read that? Can we... Do we have a thingy? Upgrades. Request shenanigans. 
Oh, I like that it says here. And then return to art. You can add this wonderful mailbox. What shenanigans? I don't think we have shenanigans at the moment. <gasps> Green Holton Bay discovered. Look at that. Perfect. 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 <laughs> Greetings from Ferrogua. Experience the wonders of the great oak forest and the serenity of the magnificent rice fields available now in Gernu Fields. Gernu Fields. Okay, we can go there. Will that mark it on our map, maybe? Oh, I can open the glims. Kiefer Sutter's cabin. <gasps> A score for a song. Oh, oh yeah, we can play the music songs. I forgot that we can play the plants little songs. Oh, there's so much about this game that's coming back to me now. I should probably have talked to the little people for before I go to the shore. Oh, hello. Hey, I came here to cut down those trees, but I forgot my axe. I'm not going to start using someone else's axe. That would be strange. I like the way my axe feels. It's so sturdy and it calms me. Oh, I missed that axe. I've been passing the time by writing letters and throwing some in the water. I've been writing poetry. It's not very good, but I'm getting better. Hopefully no one finds my terrible poetry. Oh, <gasps> yes, let's go. I just love how the cat dangles, dingle dangles from the tree. Maple logs, perfect, perfect. Oh, look, there's axes here though. That's that's so strange. Why can't they use one of those axes? <gasps> Wait, is Ashel on this island or is that a different frog? He kind of looks like he's having a spirited discussion. I was really worried that was gonna bop him on the head then. Wow, berries, these look incredible. I was just dreaming about these. I think it... Uh-oh. I should probably feed him. <laughs> Delicious. I had a hankering for this. That's better. Give him a big squishy hug. Wasn't that great, favourite niece of mine? Okay. Was recently hugged. He's eaten a meal he likes. I think he's good. Let's pick some berries. He's kind of screaming at me what what do you want to talk again <laughs> these look incredible i was just dream dreaming about these does he want some of the berries i'm working my way towards a snack okay so he's not hungry yet he's just shouting at the bushes is there anything this way i feel bad about the other little person and their um their poetry why did I forget my axe? I'm lost without it. Oh no. I wish we could have found it for them. Like, I feel like we've gone all the way to the end now. If only there was a way to find their missing axe. No, that's it. That's the end of the island. Swim on back to the boat. Poor little spirit, so lost without his axe. At least... Oh no, I took the berries. I took all of his snacks. No axe, no snacks. I guess his life kind of lacks? Okay, we're back. Let's see what this explanation point at the top of the screen is. Oh, it's our frog friend. Nice catch, Sprout. You just finished. Fished out a bottle from the sea. That's not trash. It could be anything in there. A tiny ship. Old wine. A baby crab. Yes, yes. It could even be trash. Go ahead and crack it open. I accidentally did that. Um, let's go and find another place to hang out. Let's go and find another island. 
Ooh, everything's opening up. What is this? That's like a lightning storm. We've been there, we've been there. Oh, there's a question mark here. I think this is the leaflet that we found. Or we could go... I think we've been there. And, oh, I like that it tells you what resources are on each island. Okay, let's uh, confirm travel. Then I guess we can work on our garden. Oh, still relaxing. We got linen fiber. I feel like we needed linen fiber, so that's great. Can we make linen fiber into linens? Corn seed, coffee seed. We could definitely use more seeds. Oh, it's raining, so we don't need to water the plants, of course. Can we sing to our baby um, vegetables? Um, music. R. Oh, R is inventory. Hmm. How did we sing? Do we stand on the plant? Hold it down. Yes. S A A S S. Oh gosh, S. Oh gosh. I feel like I keep forgetting which one A is. There we go. Do, 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 Oops. No, everything's terrible. Almost. No. No. Da -da, da -da 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 da 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 Oh gosh, no. Do 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 Oh, pants, pants, pants. I'm, I'm sure we did something. There we go. <laughs> Do not in quick. Oh no, what's happening? A lightning storm. Don't be scared. Want to catch as many bolts as you can. Yes, that's the spirit. Just stand below each hit. Okay, let's. Let's remember how to catch lightning. Okay. Oh gosh. I have forgotten what I'm doing. I'm sure this is fine though. Right? Okay, okay. I have to find the lightning. I, I need to go up high. No, Emmy, no electrocution. Oh, down. Maybe if I just, oh, there. Okay, I think I get it. There's like little bits of electricity where the lightning's gonna strike next. Oh, pants. Down. There we go. Up! <laughs> no! No! Please! Stop it! No! I want to get electricity! Yes! Look at us go! We're so good at this electricity thing situation. They're totally not getting electrocuted almost every second. There we go. Wait, Emmy, why were you rooting for me to get electrocuted? That doesn't seem very friendly. <laughs> me. 
there's so many. Is that all of them? Oh, that's all of them. We've just found Greenu Fields. Makes me think of Granui, the spelling. Oh, a visitor. Do you think we'll find another friend on this island? Welcome. Are you here for our world-renowned Ferrogua tours? Tour is about to start. It takes about five minutes and covers the history and flora of this island. After it, you'll be able to tell all your friends about it. Don't worry, there's no gift shop after the Oh, I wanted a gift shop. Ready? Yes. Gift shop's my favorite part. As you can see, this island doesn't get many visitors. People tend to focus on big city attractions. Here is the peaceful and quiet. There's something you'll notice with the fauna. Rice patches and a healthy forest are its main attraction. Moving on. Okay, little spirit marshmallow. Oh, he moves fast. They, they, they're really going. They're really going for it. The rice production here is quite incredible. Workers harvest around the clock to feed local families. Right now, no one is around. I'm not sure why. I sometimes play in them when I am off duty. But that's beside the point. I love this island, it's so cute. <laughs> oh, to our next stop. It's very cute so far. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, oh, oh, I'm giving a tour here. Okay, I got told off for going in front of the tour guide. Oh, this is beautiful. Is that a magical tree? Oh, oh, I probably shouldn't cut down this magical tree. Can I? Okay, yeah, that's not cut down the scenery. Oh, you can feel the humidity. I mean, really feel it. This oak forest really gets to me. I'm so glad I didn't just cut down his tree. Oh, that was a close one. We have a connect. No, they have a connection. I almost killed one of his friends. A strange connection. I tend to skip this part of the tour, to be honest. If we could move along, that would be great. Oh, that was close. Why are we allowed to? Don't get too close. Oh, is that why he starts running? Because I'm too. Is. Is. Does he think I smell? Speaking of which, this. For oh, that's so pretty. Look at the little fortunes. It's the centerpiece of the whole island. We are not sure when it was first planted. People from all around would travel here and leave little messages. Anything to help with their lives. Well, that's adorable. This concludes our tour. Barogwa Tours is grateful for your participation. Who is clearly important to them? Cut it down. No, not the fortune tree. Thank you for your ears and your patience. Thank you again for your presence. If you'd like to leave a tip, that would be appreciated. I recommend something on that. 50 glims? No! Well, that's all right. I'm making enough without it. I'll go ahead and sign you up to our newsletter. Maybe the next guide will be luckier. <laughs> no! Oh, I can't believe they tried to charge me for a free tour. Wow, but he really likes berries. Um, let's give him some strawberries. Delicious. I had a hankering for this. Uh, let's hug. Wasn't that a great favorite niece of mine? It was. These look incredible. Oh, you're just talking about the berries again. And you're happy. I guess we can... Ah, you can go back to shouting at the bushes, which I think is your favorite thing to do. It's getting dark. We should get back to the boat. Okay, should I cut down the tree? The special connection tree? Or is that too mean? Do you think like I'll get cursed if I cut down the special connection tree? I'm just going to see what happens. I... I'm just going to cut down this tree. I'm sure it's fine. It grows back right once you cut it down. We got some oak logs. Oh, there's another tree we can cut down. Sorry, special forest. Heck, what is this? Quartz dragon. I think we need quartz. We should go to see the quartz dragon. How about a meal, Stella? 
I'm starving. Oh no, I'm so sorry. Um, you can have these um fish. Oh, I do not condone the. Oh yes, you're vegan. You're you're vegan. I'm so sorry. Let's get you some pears. Oh, okay. Yes, yes. Of course, you're not being picky. Don't worry. We'll get you some grilled vegetables. Oh, thank you. I was quite hungry. Um, do you want more? You're not hungry right now. Uh, you you look quite sad, so I'm gonna give you a hug. I didn't get rejected this time. Yes. <laughs> Stella dear, doing good. I see you've been taking good care of your plants. That's good. I hope my teachings are helping you in some way. You know, I used to be quite the little soldier. Midfield State University. Ah, what was that? Agronomical engineering class of 71. Top grades and a progressive profile. I was hired right away by one of these big corporations. They put me in charge of a large parcel of land. Several thousands of acres. I was to maximize the output of our land assets. Oh, I did such a cute little little dolphin. I love that. I love that. Why does a snake have sleeves? Because they want to keep warm and show off their style. Well, that's what I did, and believe me, I did it well. I crammed the fields full of transgenic seeds. When insects came, I doused them with poison. <laughs> that's so sad. And when the soil turned grey, I pumped it full of chemicals. Great powerful stems grew upon these grounds. And plentiful, unnaturally enormous cobs. But underneath all laid an unfathomable sickness. I guess it was inevitable that I met with the dragon then. Sooner or later. Oh, that seems sad. Are we where we need to be? Oh, this. Oh, they're snacking. I thought that might be it. The dragon. I guess it is inevitable that it would be here. Oh, something big is happening. Following me always, even in this world. Our destinies, well, they're intertwined, are they not? This is very ominous. The rocks on its back seem to be oozing with corruption. Perhaps chipping away at them might soothe it. Go ahead, Stella. All creatures deserve love and care. Do what you do best. Okay, yep, sure. Yep, this is fine. But the... Maybe chip away at this. Oh, is it okay? Is it okay? What, what do I do now? Oh, I have to, I have to kill this big rock. And this rock? Oh, this thing is big. This is a, a very, very big dragon. Is this thing okay? Oh my gosh, this poor dragon. All this corruption. There's so much, so much pain it's been in with all these rocks on its back. I think we need quartz for the, the sawmill maybe? Oh, we're getting a lot of that. I just hope I'm not hurting the poor little thing. Okay. Is it okay now? Are you okay? Incredible. It looks relieved, doesn't it? I guess. The little fights are so nice and not as stressful as in some other games. Yeah, even the fight was like, it was... I was like worried about the poor creature. I wasn't like scared it was gonna hurt me. I wonder what it means. If we are ever to cross this dragon's path again, I think we should help it. However, I might feel about it. For now though, I need some time to collect my thoughts. Thank you, Stella, for everything. I hope you're okay, dragon. An old acquaintance. Oh, Atul is at it again. Oh, my food. I let my food burn. Whoops! Awkward! 
I should probably kick some corn on the cobs. And that could be more food for um, summer. I'm just going to stay here. This one's cooking quite fast, so <laughs> apparently it can. I thought you could walk away and leave it, but uh, if you leave it too long, apparently it's a big no. Let's see. Let's charter a course for another island. You can get sheep, oak log, mushroom, strawberry. Oh, you can get sheep! I didn't see sheep! I didn't see sheep there. Crates. What is this weird bus thing? A new island. Let's go. I'm kind of hoping we find another spirit friend soon. Like, that could be really fun. I also want to check on our upgrades because we've got some quartz and things. Okay, so we have enough maple. We need linen thread. Oh, so we need to build the loom first because that's how we get the linen thread. Okay, so this is cute. Let's put the let's put the loom here. Cut from the same cloth and then we need coal and oak planks and then we we can get the linen thread hopefully from the the loom this loom looks fantastic don't be scared it's in perfect working order let me show you how it works you put fiber inside and then you spin you just have to make sure you hit the target oh do we get another mini game and you get a little extra if you hit the marker needle. See? Pretty easy, right? Now you try. Try it with this fiber. Yes. Okay. We'll just put all of the linen. Let's loom this. How do we... How do we loom? Okay, so we have to try and get it over the pointer. Oh, this is cute! I like this! Mount Teroina discovered? Good job! Cool. Wait, how do I get back in and talk to... See, it's not that hard. The machine does all the work, you just have to flow with it. That was actually really relaxing. Utterly satisfying. I'll probably give it a go myself when you don't need it. But don't worry about the materials, I'll manage. Oh, we can build the sawmill now. That's perfect because we need that for our friend, Mr. Fog, because he really wanted something to do. So maybe I'll go to sleep and talk to him in the morning though, because I just realized it's like night time. Okay. This looks amazing. Thank you for helping me out, Stella. This summer is so big! What a beauty! There's just one problem. Now, don't get mad. I don't have any money to repay you. I guess that's why they call it a favor. You see what I did there? Thanks again, Sparrow. Okay, let's make sure he needs some fruit. The service on the ship is incredible. And a hug. Wasn't that a great favorite niece of mine? And then check on... Ooh, very happy. There seems to be quite a few new faces abroad. I like it, don't get me wrong. I just don't want you to forget about your old uncle at all. You know me, I miss the personality. I can get along with anyone, anywhere, anytime. I just didn't think I'd have to make new friends at my age. You don't have to worry, I'll be alright. 
Sorry, I even brought it up. I'll just go stand on the edge of the boat and take in the splendor, you know? Hopefully no bugs will fly in my mouth, there's no fun. Oh no, not the bugs! So, do we just let uh, Uncle Atoll deal with this then? Maple logs, oak logs. Sure. What do we do? Does it just... Do we do anything? Ah! You're doing it all wrong! Oh, okay! <laughs> Let me give you a hand. When you're cutting logs, you need to make sure your measurements are accurate. Then you cut. Measure twice and cut. You just need to keep your saw blade steady and on the cutting line. If you don't do it properly, you end up losing a pinky or an arm, or something worse. And a hit from the good old hammer for good luck. Give it a try now, you rascal. A measure twice, cut once, what does that mean? How do I do that? Is there a measuring device somewhere that I don't know about? That's... I mean, I'm doing the exact same thing I did last time. Would you look at that? I guess? That minigame is hard to figure out. Is... am I doing it right? I feel like I might not be doing it right. <laughs> You did great! You're ready to start cutting wood like a champ! Just remember to be careful with this sawmill. Don't go mess around with dangerous saw blades. Just because you've got leftover wood doesn't mean you should cut your hand off. Do you need to follow the curve of the arrows? Maybe. Um. Oh! Oh, Jade! 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 You fixed it. You literally fixed it. That is exactly what we have to do. Look at that. Oh gosh. We did it. Jade, you genius. I've got to tell you, there is something I'd stumbled upon some time ago, and up until now it didn't seem that important. Brace yourself. Remember my parents' manor on the lake? As weird as this sounds, it's not too far from here. Yes, I know. It makes me wonder about this world too. I must admit, I've been actively trying to avoid it. At any rate, it's become hard to ignore. I've spent much time with you here, I think I'm ready to tackle this challenge. I'll probably only find regrets and sorrows there, but it's worth a shot. I've added the location to your map. I'll be ready whenever you are. Right, Villa Magoi. A word please, Stella? Yes, of course, of course, of course. I don't know if you noticed, but I've been very tired recently and I'm afraid to say it's starting to weigh on my morale. I don't want to sound ungrateful, but I think the guest house, as lovely as it is, might not be very good for me. It's a bit too noisy and quite cramped. I hate to ask this of you really, but could you maybe arrange for me to have a little private space on the boat? I think it would help me tremendously. And then we could continue our lessons. But nothing too fancy. Just a place to sleep and meditate. With lush greenery, perhaps. Oh, and I'd be delighted if it had natural stones. <laughs> yes, that would be splendid. Okay, right. Let's go and see if we can build a guest house. Build a guest house. Can I build one of these? Oh, summer sanctuary. We need limestone. Okay, so we need limestone first. Oh gosh. No, I need to go to the island. Okay, we need to go and check out uncle, uncle, uncle. As you know, I tend to get hungry. That's just a fact of life. Sometimes when I do, I get hungry for really specific things. I've seen you yelling at bushes. 
I'm a little bit aware. Your Aunt Viv would call it laser focus tummy. <laughs> Don't get me wrong. I'll study pretty much whatever you put in front of me. I'd just like for you to put some effort into this one. I'll give you a shout when I get a craving. Hopefully I won't ask for anything too extreme. You never know with this appetite. Fair warning, Sprout. Okay, right. The guests are getting a little bit demanding. They want their own houses. They want their own food. Oh gosh, this is fine. Let's run away to the island and um and, and see what's going on. Okay, we need limestone. What's ooh, what's this? There's more of these pretty trees. Ah! Oh, is this a sheep? Oh my gosh, look at you, perfect. Oh, hello there, young lady. How are you doing? Oh, yes, right. Perhaps you can help me. You must have stumbled upon a fluffy sheep on the loose down here. I tried giving it back in its enclosure, but this stubborn creature wouldn't listen to me. Chances on your side, its weak spot is its gluttony. So it will definitely follow anyone who will feed it. Would you be a dear and give it a try? Okay, one sheep, two sheep. Okay, oh, hello. Can I, can I feed you? Some coffee beans. That doesn't sound like what a sheep would eat. I feel like a sheep would eat a carrot. There we go. Oh my gosh, look at it run. Look at it run. Oh my gosh, look at the baby. Goodness. Oh, what a nice sheep. It followed you all the way to its home. Always following your stomach, aren't you, little guy? Teehee. My sons are just like that. Don't you think it looks lonely? Maybe that's why it left. I'm going to keep it company, don't worry. But maybe. What if you found another stray sheep, you could bring it back here. They could entertain each other. Well, if it's not too inconvenient for you. Oh, I'm Alice, by the way. Very nice meeting you. Okay, so I need to find another sheep. Do you think it will be on this island? That's locked. Okay, we can't go into this nice person's house. Should we say goodbye? Have you found another sheep? I'm happy to keep you company, but another sheep would probably be better company than a silly old lady. If you ever have any clutter, I'm always interested. Maybe we could even trade. Just a sort of new curios makes my head spin. I've neatly organised my sock in errands. Take a look for yourself. But you're here now. Huzzah, if I dare say. And don't fret, budding Marina. If ever needed, old Francis will never be too far. But don't let me be an impediment to your appetite for adventure. Go on, set sail, little blue jacket. I would quite like to sell things from for you. you sell all of this uh anything else that i can sell do i have any light i need more limestone okay right i feel like that is a good place to maybe wrap up our spirit bearer adventure for today thank you all for joining me shall we say goodbye youtube Goodbye, YouTube. Oh, well.